A discerning nose is needed in the perfume business that is also in demand for a decidedly less frequent job. In today's Our Story, we'll look at the rising popularity of luo si fen, or stinky sour snail noodles. Our Jiang Shaoyi has more. Or river snail rice noodles are so popular that they were sold out for a time during the pandemic. The smell may keep some away, but some find it irresistible. The secret: pickled bamboo shoots. And the delicacy has gained tons of fans in China and created a high-paying job: stink inspector. 41-year-old Li Yongguo has to smell 300 tons of pickled bamboo shoots every day. It's at least half a month before the bamboo shoots are properly pickled. I have to smell it that at least once or twice every day and observe the color of the water as well as the quality of the bamboo shoots to see if they are ready. Lee has been sniffing for over a decade. Earlier this year, he was hired by a company for an annual salary of half a million yuan, or seventy-six thousand dollars, in quality control. The company even has its nose insured for another seventy-six thousand dollars. That we are a part of the most important part of Sour bamboo shoots are the most important part of the industry. It's worth it to pay him five hundred thousand won a year because we can't meet demand if the sour bamboo shoots are not ready. Without a professional stink inspector to control the quality, I wouldn't think that this industry can sustain. But it's not easy being a stink inspector. The smell turned off Lee's family at first. They said my clothes are always stinky after work, so I was also thinking about giving up on this. But the river snail rice noodle industry has been booming, which encourages me a lot. The production value of the industry is expected to hit 30 billion yuan by 2022. And even if others turn up their noses at him, for Lee. It's the sweet smell of success. Jiang Shaoyi, CGTN.